Hello guys, let's discuss these problem based on the circle properties I have discussed in the previous video lecture. So let's see these problems. Our first problem says the center of a circle lies in dash of the circle. You know that circle looks like this and center is the fixed point from where every point on the circle has a fixed distance which is known as radius which is known as radius. So you can see here where is the center line? Center is lying inside of this inside of this circle which means it lies in the interior. It lies in the interior or inside of this circle. And in this second problem it has been asked an arc is a dash when its ends are the ends of a diameter. This is a circle here. This is an arc. This is an arc and this is an arc. It has been said that ends of this arc are the ends of the diameter. Ends of the arc are the ends of the diameter. So this will become a semicircle. When these ends will be the ends of the diameter. So an arc is a you can write here semi circle. An arc is a semicircle when its ends are the ends of a diameter. Now let's see third problem. Segment of a circle is the reason between an arc and dash of the circle. I have told you what is segment. This is a chord. This is a chord here and this is an arc. So area included between the chord and the arc of a circle known as segment. If this part is smaller part then it will be known as minor segment and if it is the larger part then it will be known as major segment. So segment of a circle, segment of a circle is the reason between an arc, an arc and a chord and a chord of a circle. Am I right? Now let's move on to fourth problem. The circle divides the plane in which it lies in dash parts. You can see here this is a plane. Let's suppose this is a plane here and this is a circle. So this is the interior of the circle. This is the interior of the circle and whatever is outside of the circle known as exterior of the circle and this part is uh, this line, this circular line is a line of circle or the perimeter of this circle. So in how many parts this dividing the circle, this circle dividing the plane, interior, exterior plus this line. So how many parts? Three parts. I will be taking more problems on the circle in the next video lecture. Thank you.